And that's not my job. I did do my job for not, her. No, you didn't. That was not no, my job description. Part of your job is to do what must be done. <laughs> I do to not. To get <laughs> the deal done. <laughs> and you must, you must romance the cougar. Welcome back to another episode of Just One Fur, and Luke's not here to do a whole lot of talking about a whole lot of nothing, and boy, do I have a bone to pick with Sir Lucas Rinaldi. Ooh, the biggest of bones to pick, because I'm, I'm, I shouldn't be stunned, but I'm stunned. We went, recently, I went to film The Boys, Max and Lucas, and I found out that Lucas got a haircut and wore the same shirt out that he got the haircut in. <laughs> I can't believe you remembered this. How, how? Talk about how? this. How? I, I've been thinking about it for days. Ever since it happened, I've been thinking about it. How? Well, I got a haircut and I yeah. went out. And, I, and then I went out. What do you mean? You, uh, that's crazy, dude. What's wrong? You itchy, you itchy. The little hair specks all in, up in well, you. That's why, that's why they put the coat over you. The, the, the cape, the backwards it's cape. Stills, it still is the, there. I, that I mean, it really is stunning. I could not. I would not be able to function. <laughs> I just I, that's crazy to me. I like Aaron, after that, I have to go. Like, do you shower? You shower immediately? I try to. If I can't, I, I at change, least change shirt. shirt. I had. I'll be honest. I planned to change my shirt. I had a different mm. shirt picked up. Out. Mm -hmm. Not your uh, uh, tennis one. Your senior high school tennis. Shirt. No, no, not that one. <laughs> Which is cool, by the way. Is very cool. Yeah, sure. Uh, it's champion, right? Yeah, I was a champion, section two champion. Section two, good. Yeah. Um, and, well, it looks like something you'd thrift, but it's mine. It does look which like is something cool, you'd thrift. Sure. Which, in my opinion, is very cool. Well, I don't know who you is, but it's not me. I wouldn't thrift that. No, you wouldn't. Never. No, you wouldn't. Never. Okay. <laughs> all right. Now um, you got your hair all up in you. And well, by the way, yeah. I did get a haircut. Mm -hmm. And I think it, I I don't know how it looks right now, but it looked really good when I got done. Yeah. Um, but I did I did have a different shirt picked out. And Max said we were gonna go. He's like, try to dress like like flashy. We want to stand out for this. Mm -hmm. I was mm -hmm. like, okay, perfect. I had a flashy outfit picked out. Okay. Max shows up in a white shirt and shorts. He's like, yep. I don't know. <laughs> Well, <laughs> so there goes. I had I had a yeah. shirt. I had a very flashy shirt. It was a bowling shirt. Like yeah, it was like yeah. a like a kind of gross I like standout bowling, bowling shirt. I love a good bowling shirt. And then I, you know, I you would have looked great in the bowling shirt. I got flustered. Thank you. You should have just done it. Well, I did need to change my shirt. I should have changed my shirt. Yeah, but because of the hair. Because of the hair, I can't get over. I wasn't. How, I wasn't you, itchy. How you I wasn't itchy. How? How's that possible? How are you not itchy? I guess. Did my, you just like not have hair? My hair is better than yours. I don't know. That's not true at all. My hair. Well, my hair is cut better than. Who did you? Well, who don't do you even use? start with this. Don't well, who do even. Use? I don't even want to fucking start with this shit. It's, it's not who. It's, it's for. It's anybody. Forever. No, my entire life, there has never been a moment where I haven't had itchy neck afterward because there's hair particles everywhere. So it must be you. Even Max said that was crazy. <laughs> and Max is bald. <laughs> so I don't want to hear it. Okay. Okay. I, ha I have been itchy after a haircut. I have. However, mm -hmm. after this particular haircut, yeah. I was only a little itchy. Okay. Not like poison sumac itchy? No, which I have been before. You've had poison sumac? No, I've been that itchy. Pina. Oh. No, I never had poison sumac. Wow. And I don't even know if I've had poison ivy. I haven't. Which is Sh crazy. Shockingly. Which I found this out. Mm -hmm. Poison ivy only affects some people. It's not like an everybody thing. Really? Yeah. Like some people just don't get really? fucked up from Why poison ivy. Why is that? Ivy. Is it like um, so you must a be reverse immune. aloe thing? No, I just don't think I've walked into it or touched it before. You grew up in upstate New York? Yeah. Maybe I did. You were in the Boy Scouts, right? Nope. We've talked about this. I've never been in the Boy Scouts. <laughs> <laughs> I've you, never you, been in the... Aaron's to an be Eagle honest, Scout, everybody. Don't know if I've ever been in the woods. Oh. Just kidding, I have been. But well, you, you don't like camping. I hate camping. Well, no wonder you don't have poison ivy. Yeah, well, you haven't gotten it. You haven't gotten poison sumac either. I've never been poisoned. Is, is sumac worse? Actually, it's not true. Yeah, so we sumac, were Sumac's really bad. Sumac can kill you. Really? Yeah, so there's this thing, like, if you find poison sumac, like, some people, like, chop it down, like, burn it on their fire. Mm -hmm. You breathe that in, you die. 
<gasps> Scary. Wow. I know. Where is Sumac usually located? Is it like an Adirondack thing? Is it like an Appalachian Trail? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, all of is that. Is it carried on, on bears or something? <laughs> <laughs> Where does it go? It is It is a tree. Yeah. It is a, well, it's technically not a tree. It's a, mm -hmm. it's a shrub yeah. that looks like a tree. Okay. And it grows in wetlands. Oh. And it's generally a whitish hue. Okay. Um, I know this because I got really paranoid one summer. I was going to like touch mm. it. Do you think moose have a bit a large run in with sumac? Um, yeah, How many moose v sumacs do you think are happening at any given time? Any given time. Well, considering the recent tragedy, um, probably a lot. You talk about that woman who got trampled by the moose. Did that happen? Did you see that? No, dude, she got moose knuckled. Dude, it was so bad. Yeah. That's awful. It was so funny. <laughs> it's so funny there's a video the woman got like trampled by a moose <laughs> it was crazy dude. why is this funny dude this is a woman dude should she no. die i'm assuming no she died. idea no idea <laughs> absolutely no idea you're, it you're wasn't ready a to big, laugh it wasn't, you're ready to it was laugh like, you don't it was know like she's an dead. adolescent moose it wasn't an adult moose okay they're big i know have you ever dude, seen a moose dude, i saw a video recently of a grown moose that thing is a dinosaur. Dude, they're gigantic. It's insane. That they're shouldn't like as big as an exist. elephant. Yeah, it they're like 10 feet exist. tall. Yeah. I saw one in, uh, when I was in Alaska. You just saw crazy. one in yeah. person? Yeah, yeah. Well, I wasn't too close, but yeah. like I did see one. No, yeah. I, I might have seen two. I definitely remember wow. seeing one. And they're big, man. Dude, they're huge. They don't, you don't fuck around with the moose. Like, no, you people die. are like, oh, you they're die. the same size as horses? Double. Triple, they're bigger. Maybe. Quadruple. Yeah. Most cases, quintuple. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Believe it or not. What's the word for a six? Sex. <laughs> I'm not kidding. <laughs> okay. Sex topple. Yeah, maybe it's that. Maybe it's that. Sept is next. Mm -hmm. Then oct. Wheat nuf. What? Nothing. No, what? No. Sept wheat nuf. Back, what is that? It's, it's, I believe it's French. Oh. I. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, six, sept, huit, neuf. I, I thought this was like some that just came out of my the back of my brain. Some online like Tumblr thing you saw when you're like ten. What's that? Like a, a YouTube like like a YouTuber like who had like a bad catchphrase. No, so I, wasn't, I wasn't allowed to watch YouTube. You know this. No. No. No SpongeBob and no YouTube. No YouTube. What were we talking about? I think we were talking about how. Oh, your hair. Yeah. No, it was a good cut. I had AJ do it. Mm -hmm. Um. Don't know. Shout out to who AJ. The hell AJ is. Um, he's pretty cool. He, grew, he he's from he's from New York. He went to LA. And he moved back you to New York. Will never ever just take a suggestion of mine, will you? No, 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 no. no. Which is wild to I me. I have to vet. I have to vet your. Imagine like you go like it's a win win for you. How? Last time I took a recommendation from you, I got my ear cut. No! What do you mean? Because it was not the same person. If you just went to the same person that I told you to go to, then you uh, it's a win-win. You either get a great haircut, and you are like, thank you so much, Aaron. I owe you for life. And that's a win. What's the and other then win? two, the other win is something bad happens, and then you can hold it over my head. You can't hold something that I didn't recommend over my head, which you do. Never. I've never done that. Currently right now. <laughs> never done that. Right now it's happening. Aaron, Aaron, Aaron. Back. Hold the phone, Aaron. You don't recommend. You've caught me on a, in a moment when I'm on edge. And when I'm on edge, I jump. <laughs> and dude, you're coming down my throat. Whoa. Okay. Don't clip that. Hold on. You are coming after me right clip now. Clip that. You're me. coming after Reminded me Reminder to hard. me. Clip that. Don't. Um, Reminder to me. Clip that. You, you recommended this barber shop. You didn't recommend... Yes. Travis or whatever no, his name I is. No, I recommended Matthew. Matthew? You I did for sure recommend that specific person. Okay, but know this. Matthew was taken up for weeks, and I I had Shaggy. Yeah, you got to schedule here. out ahead of time. He's the owner. He's the good one. He's the owner? Yeah. Oh. Maybe I should have yeah, gone brother, I don't go to Honestly, the, I don't go to the I like AJ. that work there. AJ was telling me about getting babes. Really? Yeah. What do you know about that? Um, I had a... I had my first client today say, I love you, bye. Really? A phone call. Oh, that's fun. She hung up very quickly after saying that. I think she was <laughs> very embarrassed. Fun. Love her. Um, I had a client last week mm -hmm. ask for my number. Okay. Um, In a weird way? Yeah, yeah. Well, well, she <laughs> okay. was like, she was like, she's like, you have a girlfriend? I yeah. was like, yep. And like, oh, okay. And then she called in later and was like, hey, that Lucas guy, like, I want to be his cougar. 
I want to be his. This, this I, I want to be his. I, this is my, this Someone is my called co- your supervisor? No, my coworker. My coworker, oh. my coworker messaged me. She's like, do you know who this is? I was like, yeah. She was like weird, weird with me. She was mm-hmm. like a little flirty. She's like, yeah, she wants to be your cougar. She was asking about just, wait, you. A, cou- a cougar or a like... Um, a cougar. A sugar mama situation. Same? Well, sugar mama because... Mm. So here's the thing. She doesn't want to be my one and only. Ah. Because I told her that Cassie gets tickets for her plays uh, at the theater she works at. Mm-hmm. And she's like, well, I want tickets. So I want to. I will be your cougar to get tickets. So I'm. Parent, I guess that would make me the sugar daddy because I'd give to her. <laughs> this is wait, this is just from a, Cassie. This is a lose 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 for you. The opposite of the win win with the hair. Yeah, she gets sex and tickets <laughs> from my girlfriend. Yeah, you know what? I at first I was. <laughs> you were on board. I, not, well, I was you far from. Board. I was it far sounds like you were on board. board. It sounds like you were a little. Bit I on could board. hear the the millions of cigarettes in her lungs. <laughs> but <laughs> but at first I was flattered. Now now I I'm want, not. I want to take you to the bar. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be a cougar. I want to. I want to take you to the bar. I, I have a. I, wanna, I have a oh, my in my room. I want to. I want to put up a ticket between our faces and we both kiss the ticket and then remove the ticket really quickly. <laughs> So it's too late for him. We were kissing. <laughs> um, so that was tough. That yeah, was tough. Yeah, it sounds like a tough day for you. Um, so I, I shouted out. Uh, I, oh, oh, I had a crazy, I had a cool weekend. A cool weekend. Okay. Cool if I move on. Yeah, sure. Shout out to AJ. Well, I'm shouting out. I'm shouting out. Uh, no shout out to your guy for not being available. Like, do your fucking job, dude. Like, I don't know what, I don't know what you expect. If you're just not he's available, so you can't good do your that job. He's booked. No, he's not that's available. How, that's he's how. not available. That could mean anything. He's you're not your job. available for the cougar. And that's not my job. I did do my job for not, her. No, you didn't. That was not no, my job didn't. description. Part of your job is to do what must be done. <laughs> I do to not get <laughs> the deal done. <laughs> <laughs> and you must, you must romance the cougar. No. <laughs> no. Fired. Right. Um, shout out to Emily. Ooh. Ricky's. I think I said that. I think that's how you pronounce it. Sorry if I didn't. Sorry if that's wrong. We're doxing people. I should be. Well, yeah. Wow. I am. Um, that's Ricky's wife. Wife. What she, up, wife? She's been working from home mm-hmm. and listening to our podcast. So I just really? shout out. And uh, we're her coworkers right now. Wow. So um, stop procrastinating. Get to that thing. Do yeah. that thing, Emily. I need those sales reports, but on my desk by the end of the day. Oh shit, he's serious too. Yeah. Did you see? Did you hear the tone in his voice? Yeah, I want macro and micro. Damn. And then I'm I'm gonna need those TCPs. Yeah, I'm gonna be taking a nap in my office, just dropping Tomorrow. by whenever you whenever you get the chance. Um, so that's a big shout out. I yeah, saw, that's a great shout out. Thank I you for her. listening. So yeah, thank you for listening. I saw her and Ricky, mm-hmm. and uh, Jenna, Jenna's yeah. friend. Okay. And my cousin Gabby. Okay. And Gabby's photographer, mm. who we all thought was her boyfriend. Mm. And then we had to deduce that he no. was not just wow. a photographer. Just a photographer. They shared a drink. So I was like. Shared a drink in what way? In a fun straw way? Was it a fun str- straw. swirly straw? Was no, no swirl. Then no swirl. of course they're not together, Lucas. Oh my God. I know. You no, need no. the swirly straw. <laughs> <laughs> they have to go through each Classic other. Classic swirly straw situation. You've seen every rom-com ever. You know this. Oh, it's like two and they, they mm-hmm. interlace? Yes. Oh, it's a beautiful yeah. thing. I've always wanted to. Does that mean me and Cassie aren't going out? I've never done that. You've never done. Th- well, have you been in a place where they have those drugs? No. And buddy, I'm worried for you. Oh, shit. I know. That's bad news. Oh, shit. So I live you with have her. To get, I'll, I'll buy you a pack of them. Thank you. You are such a good friend. Yeah, you're welcome. Is this, wait, is this a recommendation? Or you just you buy can stick like pack? one in a one in a Pepsi and one in a Diet Coke and suck them together. Yeah. I thought there was something weird in there, but yeah. No. Nah. No, that was very, very wasn't at all weird, not even a little bit. Um, you That's me. I just I'm just I'm just going back a little bit. Um because I wanted to comment on this. You said I never take your recommendations. Mm-hmm. And like I just want I just at least want you to acknowledge that like part of our relationship <laughs> is that we have very different opinions. <laughs> 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 yeah, but you did take actually. You know what? You're right. And I, but you did take a recommendation of mine yesterday. And you got Popeyes. I did. Which that was a big. And wreck. you were right about. That was a big wreck. That was a big wreck, and you were spot on. 
Thank I you. ate like 3,000 calories Thank in one you. sitting and it was delicious and I've never been happier in my good. life. Good, good, um, good. Okay. Okay, so going going forward, mm-hmm. um, I saw my friend, my friend, I saw my cousins. Mm-hmm. Uh, Cassie came out too, I didn't mention that. Mm-hmm. Um, and we came out because my friend, my friend, I keep saying my friend, my cousin Gabby came up from Tampa, I think Tampa. She came Florida. up from Florida. Um, <laughs> and she's a DJ. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Are you doing that because you know she's a DJ or just... Yeah, you told me about it. Yeah. DJ Gabby Rose. Check her out. DJ Gabby Rose. DJ Gabby Rose. Um, Gabby so Rose. <laughs> <laughs> DJ Gabby. Early in the morning. Gabby Rose. Um, we saw her play at a rooftop That's in the funny. Lower East Time. The Lower East Side. It was very cool. You're having trouble speaking. Are you okay? I, I, what to compensate Eat for all water? the Popeyes I ate last night, I'm not eating very much today. <sighs> um, I get it. I get it. I had a, I had a, I had a, um, a, a fast day the other day. After, you got to have them my Popeyes. I've, yeah, dude, it's a, pa- a post-Popeyes fast day. It's only because of the crust. PPFD. Because I don't need that after chicken usually. <laughs> it's the breading and the sauce. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, no, That's re- a regular where chicken. they get you. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was like that was very uh, Jim Carrey. Oh, thank you. That's where they get you. <laughs> they do. Um, it That's is where they get true. you. Yeah, they get um, you good. So we were at the rooftop. Yeah, and there, believe it or not, Aaron Fern, there was a rooftop pool. No, at this re- DJ really? set. Yeah. Did you swim? No. Oh. Lucas, you gotta swim in the rooftop pool. Pool was closed. The pool was closed. I really wanted Did you think to go. About in. Getting kicked out though. Do you think it was worth? Do you think it would have been worth it? Well, let me tell you. Okay. Because there was a bodyguard <gasps> standing in no. front of the pool. Okay. So I walked up to him. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yeah. Big guy. Yeah. Big guy. Scowl on his face. Of course, he's guarding the pool. You know, it's the most important job apparently. So I walked up to him. Mm-hmm. And I knew the pool was closed. Yeah. And I said, "Hey, man, gonna go for a swim." <laughs> <laughs> he said, what did you say to me? <laughs> what did you say to me? You know goddamn well. You know goddamn well. And he pulls out his flashlight and he puts the flashlight on the sign. The pool is closed. So what are you doing? Come in here asking me dumbass questions like that. I don't have time. He started screaming at me and I was like, are you sure? <laughs> are you sure? <laughs> You sure you're not gonna? <laughs> Seems like he's, you need he's one. Like, I'm gonna kick you out of here. I'm gonna kick you out of here. You test me, goddamn! I'm gonna kick you out of here. <laughs> you know, goddamn! While well, the pool's closed, stop asking me. T- and then I just started walking away and I sat down. By the way, my seat was five feet in front of him. That's <laughs> so funny. And then he kept me out, and I went. I went back. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that's so laugh. funny. I don't know. Like, also, like, <laughs> you're guarding the pool. It's the most important job for someone who's unemployed. Yeah, dude, very, very important. Mm-hmm. It's three and a half feet of water. Somebody could have drowned. That's true. Somebody could have drowned. Was you said this was in the East Village? Uh, Lower East Side. Yeah. Oh wow. Yep. The Mr. Purple. If you want to go, Mr. Purple. Ooh, Mr. Purple. Right around the corner from Pianos. That's fun. Well, I wish I had gotten to meet the cousins. Mm, I like I like your brief like I like how you broke that up. Cuz cousins in law. Forget about a cuz. I'll introduce <laughs> you sometime. <laughs> dude, that was crazy. Dude, you, too fast, too, too furious. Fast, too furious. <laughs> yeah, you didn't think I was gonna reference yeah, too did, fast, too furious on this podcast, did, did you? <laughs> I didn't. Forget about a cuz. <laughs> Dude, he can't be saying that. Dude, I love that's still my favorite fast movie right now. It's my favorite fast movie. <laughs> because of first how crazy three. it is. Because because it's how so it's so it's fast and furious core. Like yeah. it's like it's like it's like how awkward can we be while also like trying to be cool? We're trying way too hard. Yeah. It's it seems it's like clearly the lowest budget of yeah. of the three movies I've seen. I'm yes. assuming the, the yes. budget keeps going up. Uh, by a lot. So they had, it's just watered down, but yeah. like funneled and siphoned and it's watered down and then, and then what's, and then boiled out so mm-hmm, that way you only mm-hmm. have the pure elements and then watered down right, again. Right. It's like putting, it's like putting a phrase through like Google Translate into Chinese and the back into English and the back into Chinese and the back into English. And that's too fast, too furious. Right. Wow. That was well said. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. If you've never done that, very funny. So, Good for laughs. You're so, looking for some laughs. Do that. So how was the set? It's good. Yeah. She's good, dude. Um, she, so is it her own mixes? 
Kind of. So I, I don't know how. It, I, I honestly, I don't know how the DJ. I was world so. Works. Con- I asked so many questions. Yeah. I looked like a damned fool. Well, no, you're up, not a damned fool. Up in that you're tower. You're not a damned fool. Thank you. So, um, so it's not her music. She didn't produce the music, but she um, did. She did mixes. So like she. Okay. I think she added drums to some of them. Maybe. I know that I know that yeah. she did. She does like filters and like she brings in other songs and like she has like tags that she like will um, loop. Mm-hmm. So like a lot of what I at least what I could tell she was doing is like there's she's like filtering and like changing like things. But she had two songs and then a bunch of samples pulled up. Okay. And but for each song she would loop a sample like mm-hmm. be like, and then she'd play the sample. I'm never gonna leave you and I'm never gonna. And then it's like, I'm never gonna, I'm never gonna, I'm never gonna, I'm never gonna, I'm I'm never, I'm never, I'm never gonna, never gonna, never gonna, never gonna, never gonna. Just it keeps growing. And then drop it. Never gonna, never gonna, never You know that? Yeah. Yeah. Where the bass is just like blowing your face back. They always put the weirder shit right before the drop. Yeah, yeah. Uh, my ears were ringing. By the way, she had that shit loud. Yeah. She played something called there's. So there's a lot of dance genres. Yeah, yeah. It's always so weird. <laughs> yeah, they have the um the craziest like names and like subgenres. Like it's not just dance. Like she played. She's like, I'm playing tech house. This guy's playing Afro something. I'm gonna play tech house to get Dude, people that, dancing. That part of music eludes me. No it really clue. does. No it, it's kind of like. Um, I'm trying to think of the, a, a way to like describe it, um, because you're taking something that already exists that someone created, sure, and then you're making it your own. Absolutely, it's a good way to put it. It's it's um so it's it but is. I'm trying der- to think of what that's what that it's compares. Deri- to. It's derivative. It's derivative. Like it's like um. Yeah. Like, think about, uh, like, let's say you had a movie, mm-hmm. in a movie. Yeah. And you recut it and re, like, colored it mm-hmm. to be a yeah. different feeling, I guess, or different style. Oh. Or, like, and you put different yeah. stuff behind yeah. it. Yeah. I yeah. think it's hard to look. I can't, I genuinely can't think you're dying. I can't think of a way to, like, compare that to something. I really can't. The it's only like, thing I can think of is you're, like, taking, um, I don't know. I don't. I don't know why, but I'm just thinking of like cooking. Oh, or there's like all the raw materials are there, and then you make something out of it. But that's kind of like just no, no, what no. The I writing think is. I think that's a good way to put it. Like you took like let's say you went to Taco Bell, yeah, and you chefed it up at home. Like like you up you spruced it up. It's like okay, ah yeah, yeah. I have a Taco Bell taco. Yeah, but I'm gonna add my own sauce. I'm yeah. gonna add like I'm gonna take out this lettuce. I'm gonna put in lettuce I like. Yeah, yeah. And I'm gonna put it put it in a different wrap. But sure, like the, sure. Yeah, the, the core is still there. Yeah, you know, it's almost right. like the modern version of covering songs because people don't yeah. really cover like, I guess they do cover songs, but like, uh, it's not in the same way. People don't cover songs enough, in my opinion. Yeah, I agree. There should be more cover because it's you don't need anything to cover a song. You nope. don't need a license. You don't need a like. You yeah, don't you're need just a allowed to do it. You're just allowed to do. It. You just have to pay them the beautiful royalty thing. Rate. By the way, yeah. didn't have to be that way. Yeah, did not have to be that way. It's wild. Um, I actually was thinking the other day, and this is kind of a, this is my hot take of the day. Um, I'm interested to see how your take on this. Um, I think that songs about Jane is the best debut album of all time. Is, that's wait wait no don't tell me don't tell me we're in five. Mm-hmm. You that was a high recommendation from you. I think it's the best debut album of all, of time. all time. That's ridiculous. Nope. It's no it's name better ones right now. You just now. said it was a hot take, so that makes it ridiculous. True. Name better ones right now. I brother, don't get me started. Go ahead. Debut. First album. It's better or my favorite? Not your favorite, better. The better a better debut album. Okay. Okay, you ready? Yep. I'm going to lay a fat one on you. Go ahead. If it's the Beatles, I'm kicking you out of this house. No, the Beatles debut was good and revolutionary for the time. However, <laughs> yeah, it's probably, I don't, I don't know if it's better than that record. I haven't listened to it much. Okay. Just when you, <clears throat> when you recommended it to me. Better debut record. 
Mm -hmm. Sour. (laughs) Not even kidding. (laughs) Love sour. (laughs) It's so good. Okay. Okay. (laughs) I guess that's fair. (laughs) I don't, I don't think that's not where you thought I was coming to. (laughs) No, I was, that's, that stunned me. I didn't think you were going to go Olivia Rodrigo on me. (laughs) Um, that's just the, that's the first that one that came to yeah, mind. Yeah, that didn't uh, that didn't come to my mind. Yeah, I don't I don't I disagree. But okay, okay. Can I think of another one for you? Sure. Think of another one. Um, let's see. Going through things in my mind. Boom, boom. Mm-hmm. Going through things in my head. Boom, boom. Going through things in other people's heads. Boom. Get out of my head. Get out of my head. Get out of my head. Even like I'm still trying to think of. I'm I'm, I'm trying to think of other other ones that are that I'm because like, boy I can think of a million better not debut albums obviously but debut right. first album well like I could name here's the thing I could name a million that I I think are better that I like much better like yeah well yeah that's yeah I, okay I, but I'm, I'm talking like like they had hits that people still love to this day from that record this was like what 2000, 2001? honestly can I can I make an argument yeah. and, and this is this is Probably not as relevant here in the United States, but if you're thinking about um, the UK, mm. um, Arctic Monkeys' first album, huge album with mm. songs that people still play today. Not as much here. Like I bet mm. you, like for all of our UK viewers, yes, I bet you look. UK- <laughs> <laughs> bet you look good on the dance floor. We're big in Europe. Um, or oh, here I just had another one in my head. Um, not Arctic Monkeys. But um, oh fuck, it just it just escaped me. Um, there's another UK band. Oh, Oasis. Oasis mm. had a huge, huge debut album. Um, a song called Supersonic, um, which is very big, but not as big here. They still play it on the radio all the time over there. But I okay. guess basically, if we're talking America, it's, it's I mean, a I, much yeah, bigger I market, don't... much bigger market. Because also, I'm ne- I'm. I'm never ever thinking about either of those bands. Ever, no, unless no. I have to, unless well, you bring them up. That's what I'm saying. I feel like, like if, I, if we lived in, if we it, lived so, in I guess it is like a little UK. bit of a different. So I'm, but vibe. But I think I'm talking like Kanye, Kanye's first record. Mm. Good, for sure. Isn't Gold Digger on that record? I think that, I thought it was the second one. Well, I got to pull up Kanye's because sure Kanye's that. first record know. goes crazy. Ooh, Dre's first record, de- Dre's debut, if you can count it. Dre's the Chronic, debut. dude. The Chronic. The cr- <laughs> talking the Chronic, right? Now, I just rap came to mind. I was like, yeah. holy shit, the Chron, dude. The Chronic. I th- I just I don't think that there's anything that in my mind beats that first record. I think we're just forgetting things. I think I yeah, genuinely think I so? I think we just don't have. Really, think things in mind that um, like I think it's better than JT's debut album. I think it's better than John Mayer's debut album. I think it's better than Taylor Swift's debut album. I think it's better than um, Ed Sheeran. Ed Sheeran's debut album. I would good, say is better he had a than good that. one. Love Ed Sheeran's debut album. I'm trying to get in your mindset right now. Yeah, his debut album was good. I don't think it's better than Songs by Jane. Let's see. What about Coldplay? They had a good I think debut. people would argue that. They had a good debut. I think people would argue that. But what was their debut? Was it not Parachutes? Maybe it was. Or no, it was the one with the moons on it, I think. Um But I still don't think I still don't think it's better. That that I, I don't know. Songs about Jane to me. What's was what's just, the what's the what's the hit off of that one? There's like four. Well, what's Sunday morning, she will be loved. She this will love, be um, loved. harder to breathe. Those four alone are just unreal, dude. I swear to, we are missing some heavy hitters right now, like really big fucking bingo bango bongo type some beats. Bingo bango bongo ones, yeah. I swear to God, I'm gonna come back at you. I'm gonna come back at you because well, I'm just I can't think, think I'm trying right to think now. artists and then trying to think of their first album. And I can't like Kelly Clarkson's debut record. Nothing but hits, dude. It's nothing. That but one hits. is really good. That could be up there. Okay. That okay. could be up there. Adele had a great debut. 
Hers was good, but again, like we're we're talking about so many people where their second one was their album was like the album for them. Yeah, which is the I mean, well, obviously, Rune Five has had bigger albums. Yeah, but I think that one's universally loved the best. Really? Yes, I'm almost positive. Okay, I have to. I'm gonna fact check you on that. I'm gonna fact okay. check you on that. I like to go to Apple Music for this. They do a great job mm. of selecting essential albums. I'm mm. sure that's one of them. Um, what's their name? Maroon Five. But does essential? How many of the uh, albums on the list? No, it's just that one. It's just that record. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah. I, can I can I just throw out some indie ones? Just because sure. the ones that come to mind when I think of sure. debut albums. Sure. The Strokes. Okay. Um, obviously, Arctic Monkeys. Okay. Um, I'm not going to say Mac DeMarco. Not so hot. Um, you're just say, you're saying things that like I don't I just don't know about. Okay. So maybe maybe obviously my my statement is based in opinion, but it's in, in I mean my, it has in my to, in my like to experiences, but but you're 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 considering best as in also like best performing. Yeah. And and, and like quality and lasting, lasting quality. Quality. Yeah. I know for a fact we're missing something. There's something really big in the corner of my mind, mm. and I can't think of it. Let's move on. Yeah. Okay. Let's move on. You got shit on. Yeah. Max and you I got both got shit on. Bad. On. Pooped on. On my hand. Yep. I, Max got shit on his head, yeah. which sucked. His bald ass <laughs> head. That sucked. Yeah. That was so, tough. So while you were walking around not itchy, I was filming you guys, and you are going to be on Japanese TV. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> this is I forgot crazy. to bring that up. Yeah, I'm going to be on Japanese You're TV. You're going to be on Japanese television. Ni hao. And that's Chinese. That's Chinese. Konnichiwa. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Konnichiwa. That's right. Yeah, we walked up to a, um, like these guys like filming something. Um, ja- they they look, they are Japanese. Yes. And um, we're like, hey, do you want a flyer? Because we hand out flyers for Land's mm-hmm. new song. Land has a new song out. Kick it with yep. you by Land. Check it out. It's our Land. best song. And a new song by Vine coming soon. I'm saying that joke. I'm not forgetting that. I made up a joke about Vine, the band. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, and I forgot it. I literally, I zoned out. I was not listening. <laughs> And uh, we were handing out flyers and we walked up to these guys and we're like, hey, do you want a flyer? And they're like, uh, sure. And they, they spoke English, but not like fantastic. And they're like, we're like, what are you guys doing out here today? They're like, we're actually filming a Japanese TV show. Do you want to be on it? Yeah. <laughs> yes. It's like, Just like that? And they're like, yo, <laughs> okay. <laughs> and yeah. they make Americans try um, Japanese side dishes and get their reactions mm-hmm. and then have, have us score them uh, one through 10. Yeah. Which was so fun. Dude, you guys are going to be such like, and the fact that at the end you got shit on by a bird. Yeah. How do I not make it on the show? If I got shit on by a bird. You guys, one, you're going to get on the show. They filmed you getting shit on (laughs) and you're, you know, it's going to be one of those classic Japanese TV, like setups with all the different graphics. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Dumb American get shit on. That's going to be you. (laughs) You're going to be a a famous meme in Japan. Oh my God. I would love that. I would (laughs) love that. (laughs) If by the end of the year you're big in Japan, <laughs> bad <be> musician. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't that be cool Imbecile though to be musician. like, yeah, we're big in Japan. Yeah, the, our our podcast blows up in Japan, dude. Not the podcast. It's gonna be you guys. You guys did it. I was I was a little jealous. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I knew you wanted to be on it. Yeah, I was a little I w- jealous. You would have had really good reactions. Yeah, because I think I would have disliked most of it. And that they would have loved that. Yeah, Max liked all of. He them. did. He was like he ten, out of 10, all 10, of out of 10, ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. He kept giving tens, and I was like, these can't all be tens. Yeah. <laughs> and at the end, so like we we gave all of our rankings, and the guy came over to us, and he's like, yeah. hey, you had a lot of tens. We need you to like in order, please. Like, <laughs> <laughs> you can't just say everything's a ten. And he's like, oh, uh, well, this is one. This would be one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, but they honestly, a lot of them were really good, and I hadn't tried a lot yeah, of them. Yeah. And there was one that was absolutely horrible. It reminded me of the strom, whatever that fish was that it's we tried. Stroma. It's stroma. It's stroma. Which he knew. You said yeah. that, and he went, "You tried that?" Yeah, they were like, <laughs> you were like blown yeah, away. They were stuck. <laughs> we should have shown them the video. But we like, hey, look at this. Yeah, we we ate it. It was disgusting. <laughs> it was eating cat shit. I don't. Even, I can't even. Dude, thinking about it makes me want to throw up again. And it one of so the dishes gross. was like one hundredth of that. Yeah, which was still really bad. Yeah, I, I couldn't eat it. It was really. It was gross. the last one you did, right? Second to last. We had one God. after that. Thank God. 
And at least they gave you some rice with it. That was nice. Yeah, that one, it looked like you were eating a tentacle of some sort. They were. No, so yeah. a lot of okay. them were tentacles. Okay. They were, a lot of them were squid. Yeah. Um, Yikes. That was gross. That and then there's gross. some of them, he's like, have it with, the, he's like, have it with the rice. We're like, what? He's like, you're supposed to have it on the rice. We're like, why didn't you tell us that? I guess I am a dumb American. <laughs> and no. No, you guys had some, you had some good banter. You think? While you were doing well, it. Well, I was trying to carry. I think that you he guys. he was not directing. Yeah. You, at all. you guys did anything. a good job. I it was. Thank you. Um. But there was, what was crazy is, while you were doing it, so much was happening around you. Like, three homeless people it's came so up to us and were like, people, they were like, give me that. Like, give me yeah, that. Let yeah. me have some of that. Like, can I have some of that? And he, had, he was like, um. Yeah, he was no. so timid. He didn't oh, know what no. to do. Um, and then after they left, he's like, New York City, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, dude, you don't live here. Dude, what, are what are you talking, talking about, about man? from Japan. <laughs> yeah. um, and the entire time I'm, like, filming, there's someone behind me having, like, a conversation with nobody out loud. Like, <laughs> In a really weird way. And so, like, I'm standing there, like, f- trying to film, and it was fun. It was a good time, but it was very funny seeing, like, the crazy people in the park. When you guys yeah. said we're going to Union Square, I was like, what are you yeah. talking about? We're going to Union Square. Yeah, like, we, we have to go to Washington Square. And then we went to, and it was much better at Washington Square Park. That was Yeah, fun. Union Square is a terrifying place. I love it. I love Dude, it. Dude, it's it's insane. It's the only place you can get it on Japanese television. That's true. That You know what? That is true. I'm so excited for that debut. We have to have a party and watch it. Yeah, we yeah we do. Well, we can't get it, but he's gonna send us the video. Yeah, yeah. I can't wait. Two months. I can't wait. Two months. And well, we can put it on the. We can put it on. Do you our think show. they're gonna overdub you with Japanese like voices? <gasps> but you're gonna be on Japanese television, and they're gonna overdub you like an anime. Yeah, I God, I hope so. Yeah, God, I hope so. And I I hope they give me like. What if they turn you into anime? <gasps> You they animate wow, me? That'd be sick. Oh, I'd love to be that'd an be anime. So cool. Imagine you and Max like animated music video idea. That is a good music That'd video. You could have AI do that easily. Oh my god, that would be really yeah. easy. Yeah. AI music video. Why have I not thought of this? Yeah. AI How did that footage come out? By the way, pretty good. Pretty yeah. good. I um I looked at it a little bit, but some of the three of the files yeah. aren't readable on my computer when I connect the camera to my computer. Really? So I had to buy an SD card reader. That's so, so weird. I'm going to see if it'll work on that, but it runs if fine not, on the I camera. Can just, you can just give it to me and I'll put it yeah, on. Yeah, I'm sure it works fine on your computer. That's Dude. wild. But yeah, because I want to put in a little snippet of you guys. Yeah, yeah. Getting I, shit on. I'll send it over to you. Um, literally shit did, on. I'm so, <laughs> you literally got pooped We on. literally got shit on. We, we, was, we tried all 10 of the, of the side dishes mm-hmm. and then the 11th was getting shit on. That was so funny. I couldn't believe like, it. Was like, a sleek turd. It was else, a sleek dude, turd. It, yeah, it looked like a worm. <laughs> it was a I, I thought pigeon turd. shit was like like a loose piece of nope. like white blob. Nah, it's just because it hits the ground. Oh, uh, splatters. It's a it's a bit of a. Getting <laughs> attacked by a mosquito. Dude, not again. I can't get, I can't get bit again. Last time I got bit, it was really bad for me. So Aaron was like, "There should be a there should be a band called Vine." Vine. And I was like, yeah, that's a good band name. Mm-hmm. But I was like, listen, I got to listen to this. Listen to this. Imagine this situation. Okay. There is a manager talking to the lead singer of a band who doesn't have a name yet. Okay. The manager is crazy in love with the lead singer of this band. Okay. But, you know, he's having a hard time bringing it up because they're talking about what their band name should be. Yeah. And finally, um, and I should mention that the manager is a vampire. Um, the manager's a vampire. Uh, finally, the vampire manager says to the lead singer, um, well, I don't I don't know what you should be, but would you be Vine? That's so fucking stupid. <laughs> it's so stupid. It makes sense now. It makes sense now, now yeah. that I've heard the, the setup. I said this all for Aaron, yeah, word I for word, and he listening. turned around and he's like, what? <laughs> So I spent like 10 minutes explaining the setup of that joke and listen to a word of it. It's like, that didn't make any sense. I, I know it didn't make any sense. You didn't listen. Is that how women feel? Yeah. Now I now I know what it's like to be cast. Yeah. Because I, when you I ask her, like, where is this You're thing? busy humming something in your head. She's telling you a full story. Yeah. <laughs> you have no idea what she's doing. And then I'm like, so what'd you do today? <laughs> you know the look. You know the I look. Did, it just told you. Yeah. That's... 
Um, so yeah. that was that was the joke I came up with. That's a good clip. Joke. That chat clip. That. Yeah, you should. Yeah, you should like film that and post that somewhere. Dude, I don't want to get shit on. It's a bad joke. I want to get shit <laughs> you on. You should do it. Dude, um, you ever? You ever? Um. Oh, go ahead. No, go ahead. No, go ahead. No, go ahead. No, I'm gonna change go the topic. Oh, I was just saying. Have you ever like, um, been so mad at what you're seeing on like TikTok or YouTube that you close out the app instead of saying I'm not interested in hopes that it'll like yeah give oh, them an extra all boost? the time. I think that should be put all into analytics. Time. I think analytics should now have oh. an option where it's like this amount of people closed the app because they were so disgusted yeah. by your content. <laughs> they they saw your content and said, I'm done. Yep. I'm, I'm, I'm done. For, I don't want to see anything else. I'm mm. out fully. Forever. Nothing could take the taste out of my mouth like like getting off of my fucking yep. phone right now. Yep. And I do that. I do that all the time. Yeah. Like I literally do the Reddit comment. It's like, all right, that's <laughs> yeah. enough internet for yeah. today. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That's enough. Um. I have mail from when I lived here that I never opened. <laughs> Why are you opening it now? Because you were doing something. I needed something else to do. Um, this is what I do. So good news update okay, on yeah. um, Capri Sun. Oh. So in response to the outrage, because mm-hmm. if you're listening to our podcast, they now come in bottles. Yes. Um, in response disgusting. to the outrage, Capri Sun, for limited time, has allowed you to be able to buy Capri Sun by... The palette. Oh. Like, like from Walmart or something? Like fr- from Walmart. You heard about this? Yes. Yeah, yeah. It's like like it's like 30 boxes. Maybe maybe 60 That's boxes. Be like of Capri way Sun. more than 30 boxes. But no, it's a palette. Like, dude, it, it's something like thousands of Capri Suns. Well, I guess we have to buy a palette. Two hundred dollars. What? Very affordable. That's extremely affordable. Very, dude, you could order it here tomorrow. And they have to they have to ship I it. I think you off the truck. Oh boy. Dude, you could do that. That's all I'm saying is you could do that. Stack them all up everywhere. You take up the whole thing. Dude, I'd have, I'd have. Make a fort, Capri Sun fort, Capri oh. fort. That's all I'm saying. That's fucking sick, dude. You'd be drinking Capri Suns for the rest of the year. And you know what? I don't think I'd get sick of them. <laughs> They're that good. They're so They're if that I had, good. If I had a million Pacific coolers, I'd say, you know what? I want a million and one Pacific coolers. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's what I would say. <laughs> After your millionth Pacific cooler, you'd be like, <laughs> another, another one. <laughs> another one. Give me another one. <laughs> Dude, I think that'd be a good skit ordering Capri Suns at the bar. Dude, that would be <laughs> <laughs> you know. Like, Let me get a Capri Sun. What? <sighs> give me a give Can me I get a Capri, Capri Sun? And a and a milk. <laughs> <laughs> and, the, and then they pull it out and you're like, you really have? And they're like, yeah. yeah. They're Capri Suns. They fucking rule. Yeah. That's yeah. the punchline. Yeah. Of course they have them. Dude, it's like it would be like uh that scene in uh Back to the Future when he's like chocolate milk. On the bar, he's like, give me a chocolate milk. <laughs> he throws yeah, yeah. three chucks in. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's what it would be like. Um, <laughs> but a Capri Sun. <laughs> you take it. Dude, Cassie and I have been making chocolate milks at home. Dude, chocolate milk is so good. I made a midnight, I made a midnight run for that Hershey's like bottle. Yes, yeah. For the yep, syrup. Yep, yep. And then we made so chocolate. You're a syrup milks. guy over powder. I haven't had powder in so long, I don't mm. remember. Okay. I'm, I remember I'm more like, of a syrup guy, I think. I remember liking the powder a lot, like a Nesquik. They're very different, though. They're different. They're, They're not both the same good. Thing. They're just very different. Yeah. Um. I think the powder is. I'm trying to say. I think it's like less sweet overload. Yeah. yeah. Whereas the, less the syrup is like really powerful. Yeah. We're talk. We're talking straight up chocolate power. Yes. Right down your gullet. Yep. And it's good. It's good, dude. Chocolate milk. There's a reason. It's so good. It's because it's milk and chocolate. <laughs> That's why. Dude, you, you know what? I always think about this. Liam used to tell me, that, so he's, he was like, a, he did swimming in, yeah. in high school. And his swim coach used to say after they practiced, go home, have a chocolate milk and a PBJ. That's the best thing for you. And I always think about yeah. that when I see chocolate milk, because no, that's not right. That's definitely well, not right. Actually. No, fuck off. Don't. No, it, dude, it's fat and sugar. Like, hold come on. on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> okay. Professional athletes on the sidelines sometimes they're given chocolate milk. No. Yep. Well, first of all, Liam's not a professional athlete. <laughs> he was in high school hey, swimming. Whoa, don't disregard his accomplishments. I've, he got a hole in one. He he's, he most certainly did not get a hole in one. He can listen to his story on this YouTube <laughs> yeah, on channel. This podcast. And it's a very funny story. It is a Go funny listen story. to it. Uh, yeah, I'll, t- I'll put a little tag in. But there is there is a plaque of him in that at, at that yes, club. There's a so club funny. that <laughs> thinks he has a hole in one. <laughs> <laughs> and he had a chocolate milk yeah. after that, I'm sure. Yeah. 
Dude, um, no, they were like chocolate milk. When you're done, it's supposed to, I don't know, help with recovery or something. Really? I don't know why, but it, yeah. Well, it's because there's so many fucking calories in it. That's probably why. Yeah, maybe. If you're exhausted. But it's so good. It is the best. It's so good. I love, a lo- Mike, I'm going to go home and have one. I'm Dude, sure sometimes I'll, I'd rather have a chocolate milk over a milkshake. Whoa, you're so real for that. Sometimes. You're so real for that. Because you know what? Sometimes the milkshake's too thick. I'm not in a thick mood. Yeah. But no. I still want that same feeling. Right, That's right. chocolate milk. Right. You want less thick milk yeah. shake. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, sometimes. Sometimes you want, you know, to change it up. Um. Yeah, did you hear about the Talk to a podcast? Yes, I did. People hate it. Yep. They <laughs> fucking hate it. They they are so mean. They're being so mean to the Haley, I think her name is. Yeah, I think so. I, I'm sure she's cried already. Yeah, a oh, lot. Yeah, a lot. Yep. It's I'm, and it's not even just like being mean. Like, hey, I don't like this. Yeah. It's like going out of their way to mock it. Yes. They're mocking this yeah. girl. This poor girl off the street, dude. She she didn't ask for the podcast. No. She didn't. They gave her. They gave yeah. a random person a podcast, and of course, it's not good. Yeah. She's trying her damn best, and she's <laughs> for a random person. She's doing pretty well. Yeah. Cut her. Cut her some slack. The talk to a podcast. Leave her, leave her alone, guys. <laughs> Uh, it's, I know it's so not how do good. You do Leave it? her alone. How do you do the hawk too? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I have to make fun Mate, of it. Go ahead. No, do it. You I go have ahead. to make fun I'm of it, I'm here to Lucas. stand up for it. I, I get it. I understand. I think sh- people should be taking uh, a step back. Hit, because her, hit sh- her with it. It shouldn't be that intense of a, of a you know... <laughs> uh, you know, coming after her online. It's me. It's, it's, it's mean. villainous. It's mean. It is villainous and it's mean. Um, however, it is infuriating... <laughs> That she has that she has a, a podcast that is getting so many views yeah. because she was in a street TikToker's video <laughs> saying Randomly. how she sucked dick, <laughs> and and I just and she we're tried. on we're about to be on year four, <laughs> 151 episodes, 151 right episodes. Same amount as Pokemon Gen 1. And that's me saying shit. Like, really? that's why we're not popular, yeah, That's, that's probably exactly um, why. But, yeah, I get that. That's, I, that's I get why it's pissed. a little upsetting. That's why She's I did see a, a really funny. funny video. I think I sent it to you. I don't know if you saw it, but it's but, a group of dudes sitting around a yeah. cafe getting ready for the house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're just like, keep cutting back to them going, yeah. <laughs> I dude, I. <laughs> that's funny. I, it is very. It, I laughed. I did laugh yeah. pretty hard when yeah. I saw that. But then I went, oh no, if that was me, man, if yeah. that was my podcast, yeah, I'd wipe my tears with my money. Yeah. <laughs> I guess. Right. That's I guess. Yeah. But still, Dude. like, yeah. I have I have it's so much crazy I have so much sympathy get. for this woman. Yeah. I feel bad. I don't you feel bad for her? Don't you feel bad? Maybe we can get on the talk to a podcast. D- next season, I think we might be able to. Yeah. Because yeah. they're pulling some hot guests for season one. Yeah. Which is carrying. Yeah. <laughs> currently they're carrying <laughs> yeah we gotta we gotta get on there i'll, I'll dm them do i will please please like, DM hey them. we have a podcast can we come on yours yeah or have Talk her on to ours it. by the way great name that is i don't want to have her on ours because i feel like she has gone on so many big podcasts they're like we don't what are we that, gonna do with that i want to go on hers i want to be the guest we give her a very down-to-earth experience <laughs> She can sit right here. We humble her. She can sit right here. Sit right right here. in the middle of us. And then I and then you can explain your method <laughs> <laughs> in contrast to hers. Yeah, and then you can explain yours as well. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Very intricate. <laughs> <laughs> what are you going over right now? My my finances, Aaron. Hope you don't my social Anyone wanna this, anyone so. wanna zoom in Should real zoom quick? In? Get some social security on there. Oh my god. It has cost me. Oh my God, a lot of money this month to yeah. go to therapy. Yep. You know what's wild, Lucas? What's that? You know what's like crazy? If someone like stole my wallet, I'd be like, good luck, buddy. You're not getting far. Why? With my cards and my everything, like you're not. <laughs> I'm sorry, you robbed the wrong person. <laughs> if you want to like get, get money, I'm not your guy. You, you're gonna, sorry. I'd be. I'd literally. I'd say, dude, you're worse off. 
<laughs> now that you have my wallet. You're, they're going to embarrass themselves getting yep. getting their card declined at a Walmart. Yes, what's going to happen. Correct. They're going to go. They're going to walk they're gonna into buy the a- nearest <laughs> Dwayne Reed and they're going <laughs> to laugh at him. They're going to laugh and spit in their face. <laughs> I, ch- I checked the funds. I, sp- I checked the funds <laughs> before. No, you didn't. <laughs> no, you didn't. And I'm going to be across the street laughing and <laughs> laughing. You're like, dude, I have so many overdraft fees. I can't like, go more under. Come on. Let, let me take it. <laughs> On, no, keep honestly keep it. Yeah, <laughs> honestly keep it. No, go ahead. I'm actually gonna change it to your name. <laughs> please, please take it off. Yeah. yeah, they just they stole they stole the wrong person's stuff. That's for sure. Um, please rate my haircut in the comments. Uh, one through ten. One, one being great. One. Ten being really great. Okay, I'm gonna go with a solid. Mm. Thank you. That's my official review. That's pretty. That's. Mm. <laughs> You've never played Minecraft? That sounds exact. I have played Minecraft. That sounds exactly like Just a villager a noise time. in Minecraft. Do it again. Mm. Oh my, that's spot on. Is it really? That's all my all, all my crafties. In the <laughs> Dude, you've mentioned the craziest, <laughs> most niche nerd shit this episode. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I just I am I am oh, my neck hurt. hurts. My neck. Dude, it's like it's like have you know the um who's who's the guy that, you know who who's the I, you're, I you don't know anyone. There's a pod. You, there's a podcast I see anyone. on the on the talk, and, and there's the guy who goes, mm, <laughs> actually, um, with the, one of the guys' names is Liam. Are you talking about the uh, Friday beers guys? I think so. I think so. I think you are. Um, and he always says, um, "Well, according to the 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 Nuff Swuff, actually, contraband. yeah, yeah, I think that's the Friday beers. Yeah, guys. yeah. Um, what the." The one guy who always does like the cringe, the cringe character. Yes. He did a cringe character that was just quoting a book he read. <laughs> like he is the nerd he's yeah. like making fun of. I didn't realize this. Yeah. He is the biggest nerd because he just quoted a Brandon Sanderson book that is <laughs> well respected fantasy author. Yeah. He just he just went through the history of some like tribe <laughs> in this book so funny, as yeah. if he was making fun of people for knowing it. Yeah. I checked the comp, so everybody's like, "That was lore accurate." What you just said, <laughs> <Yeah>. like, <laughs> like d- dude isn't joking. Yeah, <laughs> he's not joking. Dude, you should do that with some like that deep me. Lord of the Rings things. Yeah, or like whatever you're. Re- you are kind of doing that with the Revolutionary War. Stuff. I am. No, I, well, yeah, I'm very. I'm. I'm not even making fun of myself. I'm. I'm dead serious. But no, the Revolution War stuff. War stuff is awesome. It's dude. It's sick. It's very cool. It's I love sick. learning about like war history. I think it's really cool and and like it's interesting. Cool. Um. Well, yeah. when out, well, actually, okay, I can do one. I can do one. Actually, when out, I awoke the dwarves. Uh, Eru Uluvitar became very upset because the only the elves was first to or to be to be the first to awaken because they were the first children. So the first to awaken once the elves were awake was mm-hmm. Durin, and Durin's folk began, and he he created Moria, where Gimli comes from. Gimli, son of Gloin. Correct. So that's that could do that with Lord of the Rings. I could. Um, really quickly, John Bellion just finally teased a new song. It's been six years. Let's go! Let's go, John Bellion! John Bellion! John Bell Pepper! John Bellion! John Bullion Cube! For a song, what's it gonna be about? Go okay, go ahead. What's what's his inspiration? The song is called Kid Again. Oh no. And he's John. No, <laughs> John, don't. John, no, you not can't. Another kid, not another kid. Not a kid. A, a kid again. No, it's, <laughs> again. It's John. A, it's a. It's a song about because uh, he got basically he finally got his rights back and he got his his music back, his masters back. He got his his label agreement is over. Like is oh. Up. So he's now like officially like. Took him long that's enough. why he hasn't been making music over the past six years. He didn't want to give them anything. So. What has he been doing? He's been producing? Just producing other people's music. Dude, you know he's going to come back horde. Yeah. You know he has been writing. Yeah. Yeah. And he's got a stockpile of a million of the best songs in the world. Yeah. Yeah. So he released a video um, that was just like a, a link. Like, just he posted a link, like on his notes app, like just posted a link. Everyone went to it. And it's like a video of him like working on the song and then talking about like how he got his record, la- uh, his, his agreement like overturned and like he's like ready to start making music again for himself. And for the past six years, he's just been producing other people's stuff to get like a really good rep in the industry and like really increase his, like his just skills and like hone his skills and stuff like that. 
That's very cool. So I'm excited for that. That's just a little teaser for me. That's, that's, that's a good thing in my life. Yeah. I love that. What, what if we ended the podcast with a good thing in our lives? Oh, I like that. Yeah. I love that. This I is my, that. that's my, that's my um, thing I'm looking forward to. Yeah. Good thing in my life. Mm-hmm. I'm going to a wedding. Wow. This weekend. Fun. Very excited for this. That'll be fun. Um, But I'm, I'm, I'm a weirdo. I am yeah. mostly uh-huh. excited for the trip there and back. Oh. I have a train. Okay. And um, I love reading on the train. Nice. I'm really excited to do that. That'll be fun. Yeah. More about the about the war. Yeah, I was thinking. I was either going to bring the war. I was going to, or, or I was going to bring. Going to bring the war to the west. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck ye, loyalists. Fuck ye. Does, does anyone? <laughs> Does anyone have any reason? <laughs> These two should not be together. Well, in 1776, <laughs> <laughs> George Washington declared that Trump would be the next him. <laughs> Great comment, ABB. Great comment. <laughs> Great comment. Oh God! Well, Which, by, by the way, then. was wild of you, ABB. I, I don't, I don't, <laughs> I, I don't, I don't see the comparison. Be honest, I do not, I do not see it. But. Yeah, boo, boo. But I'm sure there's a line of reasoning there that yeah. makes sense, and I would I want to hear about it. I will be visiting ABB. Oh, fun! Um, maybe next month. Well, that'll be fun. That'll um, be a good time. So either I'm either I'm going to bring the war. Yep, the war because yes. there's no other war, of course. Or I'm going to be bringing that uh, the the Brandon Sanderson book that that guy was making fun <laughs> of. Course, because oh, I was like, fucking I was like, well, if you like them, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh <laughs> my like god! Too. Alrighty, well, that'll be nice for you. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. Exactly. And that'll be nice for you too. When does the song come out? Uh, I May? believe in like two weeks. Yo, that's soon. Hold well on. Okay, well, thanks for listening. Yeah, thank you for listening. Uh, please subscribe, subscribe. Follow us on all social media. Like this. Let us, do- <laughs> uh, let us know what you think about Lucas's hair. And that's all that we got for today. Thank you for listening. We'll see you next week. Ooh, ended with a burp.